Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mr. Roxana, it's Daily Rambles. Today, we're doing Arrow, and we're doing Season 4, Episode 18, and it's called 1159. And so, we start off with Andy's looking for stuff, then Diggle walks in on him, uh, he's like, oh, I'm just trying to find, see if there's nothing that could hurt the family or whatever, and Dig actually buys that, and still trusts him, and tells him about Merlin. And then we cut to Oliver, tells them about the idol on the Lian Yu, so he finally, finally tells them about that. Then Dave backs Andy when literally um, he's, um, when Oliver confronts him about it. And then we cut to where 40 other percent of the votes were still in Oliver's name as a write-in when dropped out. So Miss Adams wants Laurel as the DA. Then Malcolm shows up at the lair. Then it's Team Arrow versus League of Assassins. And it's Thea versus Malcolm because they're after the totem. And But um, it was a decoy of the, the shipment that they were going after. It was a decoy. And so the idol is gone because Malcolm stole that from the people in the, in the Arrow Cave, which was a Laurel and Thea. And so the idol is gone, and Oliver is really suspicious of Andy. And then we cut to a flashback scene where uh, the plan works, where they're trying to get um, the the gunmen of Riker's team into the cave, and it works, and they overpower them and take their guns, more the guns. And then we go to the present day where um, it's Lance family time, and then Andy says Oliver when they're uh, doing um, trying to find more people and then we cut to where Malcolm gives him the idol but it's, it's missing the piece and then Diggle tells, Andal, tells Andy that the piece is missing because Andy is like what about the idol we got to have we going to be prepared, protected from the idol and um, he literally tells Andy there's still a piece missing and uh, he has it And then uh, we have a flashback scene where they rescue the prisoners and tells them to escape. Then we go back to the present day where Dart threatens Laurel. And because uh, she, sh she shows up to the prison to uh, search all the cells. Well, mainly search Dark's, Dark's cell. And she's like, uh-huh. Okay, bye. <laughs> when he threatens her. Then we cut to Andy is looking for something again, and then Oliver questions him, slash accuses, accuses his, he accuses him. And then uh, as he's starting to question him, Diggle comes in and then pulls a gun on Oliver, then tells Oliver to leave his house. And then uh, Diggle is very furious at him. And then, uh, then Dark's prison pal, Mr. Zip lips basically gives uh, gives Dark a book, and then th there's a prison pandemonium where the entire prison goes haywire and people start killing everybody. Definitely the guards first. Though. This team era versus Dark. Then you legit have all the fight scenes. I mean, all of the fight scenes are happening right now, all of them. And they're all really cool all fight scenes. I'll say that. They were all really cool. I don't know how they learned all that crap in a week, but kudos to y'all. So then we have Andy, then portrays them and gives Dart the final piece. And of course, Diggle gets very upset, but no one else was surprised at all. Come on, the viewers. Then Dart gets his powers back. Then Dark literally stabs Laurel. A flashback scene where um, Tiana and Oliver blow up the cave and they make a deal with the girl. Basically, like, um, if I'm killed, go back. Oliver says this to Tiana. Like, if I'm killed, please go back to my family and tell them what happened. And she said, okay, but if I die, you gotta do the same for me in Russia. So then, um, then we see where Riker kills all of his men because they're all trapped into the, in the cave with him. So he literally kills them all. 
And then we go to present day where Laurel's in surgery, and then Diggle blames himself as he freaking should. And then um, they say that she'll be fine, and she's wheeled into a room. Then Team Arrow talks to her, but Oliver stays with her. And um, she kept the picture that Oliver gave her. And she tells him about how she was the love of her, that Oliver was the love of her life. And then, but glad he found it, but he, but she is glad she found it with, that he found it with Felicity. And then makes Oliver promise something, but we don't know what she said. And then Laurel starts seizing up, and then Laurel dies at 11.59, and there's dev- devastation all around. And that's the end of the episode. Very insane episode. I really like this episode, but I'm going to give this a B plus just for the sheer betrayal of Andy, because it wasn't really a betrayal. I mean, it should have dragged on a little bit more, in my opinion, about him trying to turn him into a good person or stuff like that, but they kind of sped through it and just kind of threw him like, okay, you're good now, but you're not really, and you're going to betray him in the end, bye-bye. I mean... Anyways, but other than that, excellent episode. I love how emotional and they were about Laurel and stuff, and um, I just, I love this type of scenes so other than that awesome episode and then that's what I did for this video I still know how to do a proper transition from the end of the video to please like comment and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video I don't I'm weird with that anyway I said it so I'm not gonna see you again I want y'all to have a super awesome day I'll see you later bye everybody